Hi guys, I'm Juliana, and I'm in the driver's seat. I'm Zach, and I'm in the back seat. This is Undertale, and we're doing it wrong. Yeah. So uh, we just beat Undyne. Yeah. Sort of. Well, that's as close as we're gonna get right now. Um, so we have a couple ways to go. I'm not going to the guys in the black armor. Yeah, hold off on that. That that seems like a bad and terrible idea. I have. That's a lab. lab. Okay, I'm human. Nope, not going to the lab. There's your fast travel. Good to know. I think they can take you to Waterfall or Snowden. Okay. That's not what I need. Lab it is. Shit. Mm hmm Shit. 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 Oh, I need, I need healy things. I used all my healy things. Yeah. I have lots of dog residue. You do. Hi, guys. It's too dark to see near the walls. It's you? Oh, there's dog food. Guess what? It's too dark to see near the walls. God. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered, I'm barely dressed, it's all messy, and... Um... Uh, uh, hi. Hiya? Just... I'm Dr. Alphys, I'm Asgore's royal scientist. But, but, but uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on the screen really makes you root for them. So, uh, now I want to help you. Aww. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. Uh, a long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a, a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, anti-human anti combat features. Of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so. And, um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> but, um, hopefully we won't run into him. Did you hear something? Oh no. <laughs> oh yes! Welcome, beauties! To today's quiz show! Oh boy, I can already tell it's going to be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. <laughs> Never played before, out gorgeous. Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or die. Or you die. Yeah, how did I see that coming? Yeah, right, big shocker. Metaton attacks!
check it. Uh, attack 30, defense 2, 2, 255. His metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Watch, yep. Right, sounds like you get. The quiz show continues. You're noticing what Alphys is doing, right? A little bit, not. So, the quiz show continues, so just do whatever. Well, X. X, I'm just gonna yeah, go just straight spare. to Murphy. Here's your terrific prize! What's the king's fool's name? Oh shit. Uh, so look what look what um Oh, she's doing She's this. telling you the answer. Enough about you, let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Too easy for ya, huh? The quiz show continues. It's another easy one for you. Two, Two trains. trains, train A and train B simultaneously depart station A and train and station B. Uh, yeah, whatever. Yeah. <sighs> Don't. Don't count, count on, on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? You're so lucky today! Let's play Memory Game! Oh, fuck. What monster is that? That's a frogget. Oh, god damn it. I forgot that he did that. But can you get this one? Would you smooch a ghost? Great answer! I love it! The quiz show continues! All you have is dog residue. Oh dear. How many letters in the name Metaton? <laughs> of course that was easy for you! Time to break out the big guns. In the dating simulation video game, Mew Mew Kitty Cutie, what is Mew Mew's favorite food? In the fourth chapter, everyone just buys ice cream for all our friends, but it's a snail flavor and she's the only one who wants it. But it's one of my favorite parts of the game because it's actually a very powerful message about friendship and... Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphys have a crush on? Seriously? My, my. How conceited can you get? I love it. And while you are completely wrong, you deserve some credit. I've seen her watch you on her computer screen. Smiling when you succeed. Shrieking when you fail. And always, always whispering. No, wrong, you have to go that way. <laughs> In its own way, is this not love? Well, well, well. With Dr. Alf is helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. Well, that was certainly something. Is you again? Okay. Do I want to talk to Alpha some more? Probably. As well. That, that last question. He wasn't s supposed to ask that one. And that's it, probably, ma'am. Probably. <gasps> wait, wait! Let me give you my phone number. 
th then may maybe if you need help, I could... What? Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting. W wait a second, please. But Goat Mom! Here, I upgraded it for you. <laughs> it can do texting and items. It's got the keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to the bathroom. You don't have any room in your inventory. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Wonder what that is. Seems like the. Oh! Right. Seems like a walkthrough to the game. <laughs> <laughs> you might want to drop some of your dog residue. Yeah. How do I do that? C, C. Okay, items. Yeah. I mean... Oh, what you could do is you could probably dupe it until you have a bunch of dog salads. Yeah. What a piece of trash it is. <laughs> and we're back. <sighs> Left to right. Okay. Seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. Eh? You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They're all labeled human history. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book, it's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. All these books are labeled human history. Just, uh, you look inside it's a, a book, it's, it's a comic, comic book. book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Pink goop drips from this strange machine. Cool. Like Elvis's work table seems dusty. Okay. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. That doesn't sound familiar at all. Fine. There are letters from many. Letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. Oh. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. Incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> Can you look at the poster? Uh, behind it? Yeah. No. But maybe this one. It's a promo poster for Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, thank you for making my dreams come true. Aww. And now he's a murderous psychopath. Cup of noodles. <gasps> it's a beat up figurine of a female human with cat ears. Can I see the... Can I see... It's a teacup shaped <gasps> like a yellow lizard. Yay! It's full of soda. 
Sorry, I'm very happy about this. It's a Why? computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzles. Yeah. yeah, okay. Why does that make you happy? Wait. Is it... She has her very own teacup that looks like her. Okay. It's very cute. Okay. Like it's adorbs. What's in the kitty hole the hole? No. No. Alright. Um, so... Or oh. wait, no, there's like five minutes there. Keep going. Fuck. Hmm. Oh, it was updated set. I just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Well, I know she's unbeatable, and I'll ask her about it later. <laughs> For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it's like Twitter, and it just kind of happens. Well, we know which way it has to go. Vulcans! Oh, God. Oh, God. Mistakenly believes it's lava can heal people. Oh boy. Oh. I'll help healing magmas. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Who? Oh, oh, oh. Incur. Okay. Mm. So lovely. Bear that bitch. Yay! Okay. <gasps> Gonna call them in a minute. Oh boy. Cause that's not. That's not really ominous. Really awkward. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, LMAO. I don't think that's a good idea right now. I think it might be your only choice. Because what's up? I didn't find out. Thunderplane! Gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. Wait, why would I like you? Oh, Jesus. God damn it. You get close to Sunder Plane, but not too close. Hick, hick, human. Damn it. Right idea. Yes. For execution. Smells like an airport perfume counter. Accidentally bumps you with its wing. <laughs> it gets super tiny. Okay. All right. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything up. So. Oh, not that I can get there. Okay. Yeah. So let's wait. Yeah. On All this right. one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank, uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Let us know if we're doing it wrong in the comments below. We'll see you next time. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Do a little.